Mark Zuckerberg recently announced that Meta is the new name for Facebook Inc. He stressed the metaverse puts people at the center of technology and is more than a mobile app. Up until a few months ago, metaverse was not a word thrown around in everyday conversation. And now that word is everywhere. And guess which famous twins identified that area first? As we move more and more closer to the metaverse, you'll want art in your online world. And I think that people already play a lot of video games where they're buying goods and services inside the games, but they can't really take them out of that walled garden universe. Yeah, right. I don't think I'll use the word metaverse, did you? Um, I need to ask you, since you use it, if you could just please define what is the metaverse? The metaverse is basically an online, the recreation of the offline world in the online setting. I think a good example of the metaverse would be Fortnite where kids basically sign in, or even adults really, uh, people have signed in and they even have held electronic music concerts. I think Marshmallow hosted a, a concert in, in Fortnite. People signed in to go see him play in this virtual world, not in an offline setting or a com concert venue. Um, and so that's, that's sort of one example of a metaverse, but it is a closed world currently. And we think in the future, those worlds open up. This is the third time Zuckerberg has followed them into a space they identified first. I think that what we identify with is this idea that you're crazy and, and nobody really, you know, it's the, that quote that people often attribute to Gandhi. First they ignore you, then they laugh at you, then they fight you, then you win. And quite frankly, we've been crazy a lot uh, in, in the past, you know, two decades or so. Um, and, and so I think we identify with that frontierism, like being really far out there, where it's sort of this secret hiding in, in plain sight, if you will. The idea of a metaverse is easier to understand when you see these tangible examples, especially in video games. But the question is, will people want to exist in Mark Zuckerberg's metaverse?